Greetings, dear ones. I'm Kryon of Magnetic Service. The process of channeling is too strange for many. It doesn't fit into the mold of everyday life, you think. Humanity judges things based upon what they know and not what they don't know. And therefore, this does not fit into a known quantity of the way things would work. And so the process itself is questionable. And depending upon your bubble of reality, depends on how questionable it is. Even those who would expand that bubble to include unseen energies that they don't understand, they're still not aware of what the energy is. I'm going to try to tell you a little more about that tonight. I want to discuss a little more about the bigger picture in a way I haven't done before. But I want to ask you right now, is this real? And what is it that you would have to do right now as you sit here to make that decision? Do you feel it? Do you intuit it? Do you analyze it? You listen to it later and take it apart? Do you count the words and look for numerology? And the answer is no, of course not, none of those things. And what do you do? And I'll tell you, you learn to feel an energy you don't understand. Do you believe you have in yourself, dear ones, a piece of the creative source? Call it what you wish. In this galaxy, do you believe where you sit that you might have a piece in you of God? Could it be that inside your DNA, which represents everything that ever was with your soul, could there be the seeds of other civilizations on other planets? Now we're getting weird. And in those questions are truth. But it takes a certain kind of energy, past discernment, that will cement those things into your reality. And therefore, you remain divided. Even a group like this, when interviewed later, will say, yes, he was channeling. No, he was not channeling. He was just enjoying something for himself. And others will say, I sat there and I received the healing of my life. <laughs> side by side, in a group just like this, there have been those who would walk away in disgust and the one next would be healed. And so then you get into the questions of psychology, appropriateness, what is it the mind might be able to do with itself through belief, and all of the machinations of your thinking that would explain something that I will tell you is so intrinsic and simple, you don't even see it. You're not built yet to see it. You're filled with an older energy that you grew up with, and there is no judgment in this. It just is. Your biology right now as you sit there is a product of your upbringing in a world that has dark energy in it. And you have battled this dark energy even with the lightest thought you would have. This has been an uphill battle all your life. You sit in a room like this and I guarantee that your friends don't know you're here. Your family, some of you. You haven't told them you came to see a channeler. Maybe you told them you've come to see an author. Sounds good. And that's because there's a division of belief. 
and the odd thing. And someday you will see this as funny. Is that the very thing that you think is odd and strange and weird is going to be the sustenance of this planet eventually. <laughs> Unseen energy. Energy not understood or explainable right now will drive this planet's future later. And so you are now just beginning to tap in and say to yourself, could this be real? So for those of you who know it's real in your heart and can feel the connection to this voice, to your higher self, here is my message to you. Dear old soul, you are here for a reason. If you are perplexed in your life and there are challenges before you, I would like you to put them aside and celebrate just for a moment, just for an instant, your magnificence and the fact that you're in the right place at the right time doing the right thing. It's not a coincidence. There is guidance, there is benevolence, there is love, there is purpose and a plan. And all of these things have been hovering above you all of your life. Some of you just coming online. I know who's here. Some of you just barely aware that it's all there. Some of you have depended upon it all your life. Some of you have used it without ever thinking or identifying that it has a spiritual basis. It's all been intellectual, but it works anyway. It doesn't matter. The rules are the rules. There is a physics involved. I'll tell you about that later. It's not just strange stuff. You've been on the periphery of it for a long time. I want to tell you about that later tonight. Try to explain a larger picture to you in a way we haven't done before. Is this real? Those who have heard these short messages before will recognize the theme. The theme is, do you believe it or not? And if you do not, and you walk from this place saying, Lee Carroll is an entertainer. And what he did in the chair, meh. I'll tell you something. We love you. <laughs> There is no judgment of your judgment. <laughs> Old soul, you are magnificent because you are here. Your very essence on the planet helps this planet, even if you walk away in disbelief. We've said it so many times, the same number of angelic entities or whatever you want to call them walk out with you who walks out with the channeler. And that means there's always a hand available for you to take in times of distress. And you may call it whatever you wish to. And you may never listen to a channeler again. And I'm going to tell you, you identify God any way you wish to. And God will be there. A benevolent energy of physics. It'll be there. An intellectual pursuit of energy that's beneficial. It'll be there. Because the plan is the same no matter what name you give it. But I give it love. Unconditional love for all eternity. Because you're part of me. The great central source is an energy that cannot be described. That's where you're from. That's where I'm from. We are brothers and sisters. Human being. I'm part of your family. You're part of mine. And you may or may not ever, ever know that until the last breath. And it's okay. The message is clear. Look for this in any way you wish. Look for this. Give it any name you want to, but proceed and balance and live longer because of it. That's just step one. We'll be back. And so it is.